Hello viewers. It's Z on Saturday for Out of This Binary. And today is a free topic, so we can talk about whatever we want. Before I start the video, I want to apologize if it's not that good because I am so tired. I've been sick the last three days and it's just not a pleasant experience. So if I sound weird or if it's a bit off key, then that's why. So, uh, for free topic, I wanted to talk about my gender identity. Specifically, what is it? See, that's a good question because I'm not completely sure. When I first began questioning myself and thinking that maybe I was non-binary, I thought maybe I was agender because I couldn't really locate any sort of gender feelings in myself. Um, so I was like, you know, maybe I don't have a gender. And that's why I don't feel these feelings that everyone else seems to be feeling. But as I listened to um, what other trans people had to say about their genders and just listen to myself a little bit more and begin to understand gender a little bit better, I realized that I do have these gender feelings, but I just wasn't, they just like didn't feel the way I was expecting them to feel. And that's why I was a little bit confused. So then I, w I realized, okay, I'm not a gender, so I have a gender, what is it? and I thought about it. I'm still thinking about it, been thinking about it for multiple years. And I, I've come, I've knocked off a lot of possibilities. Like being um, androgyny or androgyne, or however you say it, or whatever. Basically being a mix of male and female. Not, not that. Um, stuff like being gender neutral, or neutral. I'm not that either. So, right now, I'm kind of, at this point in my life, I'm kind of thinking either a lot of the time, I feel like I'm not a girl, not a boy, but I'm something. But there are some days where I'm okay with being called a girl or thought of a girl and it doesn't really bother me that much. And I can't figure out if that is varying levels of dysphoria. So like, I am my gender all the time, but sometimes I just don't have dysphoria over being called a girl and sometimes I do. Or if I'm actually gender fluid. And see, the thing is, is when each day, when, whenever I'm experiencing my gender, it just, it feels so like it should be like that forever. But see, most of the time I feel like I am my own gender that is not male or female. But sometimes I feel like okay with being a girl. And then sometimes, very rarely, but I feel kind of like a guy or like a mix of male and female but those things are all rare and I don't know if it's my like if I'm feeling more masculine and feminine or if I'm actually feeling male or female does that make sense like maybe when I when I'm okay with being called a girl like I'm just feeling more feminine um and there are definitely times where I like to present 
like some days I like to present feminine, some days I like to present masculine, although most of the days it's feminine. That's just my style. But so I can't, I'm like trying to figure out like gender expression feelings and if they're separate from actual gender feelings and if I'm gender fluid. Maybe I'm gender fluid. And it's just very confusing. Because most of the time, I feel very firmly not male or female. But some of the time, it changes. Which, when I hear myself describe that, it's like, that's like exactly what gender fluid means. But I'm still kind of doubting myself, and I don't really know why. It might be partially because I don't really want to be gender fluid. And it's not because I think there's, a, there's anything wrong with being gender fluid, but it's just, it would be so much harder to explain that than to explain being one static gender. It's like people have trouble understanding me being neither a boy nor a girl, so if I tell them that my gender changes, like, they're gonna be like, what? Your gender does what? <laughs> <laughs> so that's kind of like maybe I'm my reluctance to accept being gender fluid is keeping me from realizing my gender identity or maybe I am truly not sh sure and I don't know <sighs> I don't know And I don't really have any anyone to talk about it with. Like, I have some people I can talk about it with safely, but they don't understand. They really don't. Because they're not trans. Are any of you viewers, like, questioning your gender identity? Like, or, like, maybe you think that you're one thing, but you're not completely sure. Or maybe you were questioning and... How did you, how long were you questioning? Like, did it take you a long time to find out? Like me? <laughs> or was it pretty apparent? I don't know. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this free topic video. And next week, we're getting back on scheduled topics and we're going to be talking about relationships. <laughs> so, uh, okay, I think I'm done with this video. Feel free to comment if you have any similar experiences and if you want to talk to me, um, I'm going to put my Tumblr in the description box. Okay, this has been Z on Saturday for Out of the Spinary, and I'll see you next week. Bye!